Hey, it's me and and my sisters. <laughs> and we're about to go in this abandoned car garage. That is huge. I didn't realise it was that big. Inside. It's bigger than it looks, Jack. Jack, it's even bigger than it looks there. Yeah. And there's another, oh yeah, there's levels up there. I brought a torch. Did you? Yeah. Oh, cool. And so I will talk to you later. We just came in that window. What is this press? There's like a book here. Oh, it's a Viking catalogue. What, what is this? This is like a printing press. Oh. No, it's to, you park a car on it and then it lifts it up. And then you can go underneath and fix the car. The underneath of the car. And there's loads of birds that live in here. There's like, there's an exercise thing. Oh, someone's been doing some painting. Oh, the... Of course it is, look at the chest, look at all the birds. The plants are going... <laughs> I nearly just slipped. Steph, come and look at this. What? What is it? Find a hole in the ground. There's no holes in the ground. Well, if there's no holes, what the hell is that? <gasps> it's a dead It's into a drain. Down here there's um, some holes. Obviously they did the same sort of thing here, they parked the cars and then walked down and went underneath the cars and fixed them. And they got oil tanks. I wanted to go through that graffiti to post, but there was nowhere I could go. The camera. Why couldn't he not have gone here? Or gone over there? You could easily walk over there. Or walk around that way. Go and have a look in there. It looks like an alien. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at all this crap. What, you mean in here? Yeah. I don't want to now. There could be someone in here. What do you mean? Oh yeah, I get what you mean. That does look like an alien, doesn't it? I, you guys, this is going to be really weird, but I need a wee. No, don't. There's a toilet there. People have gone for graffiti in here. And there's mattresses. There's probably there's probably needles and stuff around here as well. Oh, there's there's a perfectly good rug over there, and some food. Do you want the chicken korma? There's a chicken korma right there. I'll talk to you later. It's where there used to be urinals. That's why they look like aliens, because the urinals used to sit on there. I feel a bit vulnerable because the roof's caving in. I feel like it could cave in on <coughs> any second. Look at all the bird shit. Oh my god, I wondered where the girls had gone, but they're over there. Oh my god, that is freaky. There's like a cat. I'm gonna go and see the girls. Yeah, I'm coming! How did you get over there? I wanna come over this way. On the right. I know my right from my left, I just wanted to climb over the wrong bit. Canteen. They have a canteen here. I sat there. You sat up? I sat up there. The reason that we're here is because my sister found, well, didn't find it. She wanted a place to do a photo shoot. And she was just saying she sat up there in that window and had some photos taken. I'm definitely gonna come here when I have my DSLR. This is cool, I'm definitely gonna have to come here with my camera. So. Yeah, I saw that. Oh my god. Wow, this goes really deep. There's a fridge, there's an office. 
Yeah, there's glass and stuff around. Does Dad need a new printer? We got one over here. Just look at the background. Yeah. <laughs> That's really cool, though. I'm going to have to come here and take some pictures. Yeah. Filing cabinets. These, these ones are concrete. Oh, yeah, we're going to... Is that how you get upstairs? So how did you get upstairs then? Yeah, I do. I love it. Hold on, let's wait for Steph. This is how I got in. Oh. No, this is not how I got in. <laughs> I see. Used to be a door. No, yeah. yeah. I see it. You came in on your own? Yeah, the very first You came in here at night? I would never come in a place like this at night on my own. I would be so scared. I mean, it's really nice during the day. It's really nice during the day, but there's no way I'd come in here on my own, even during the day. Let alone during the night. Actually, Jack, I think I went to in the night to see if there was a way in. Then I went the next day to see what it was like. And then I brought Chris. Jen came in here on her own at night. No, I didn't actually Maybe. Walk in. No. I think I looked no. around the outside. Steph, we found the stairs. Okay. You just want to be quiet, don't you? I feel like you should. I don't want to. I feel like I, I don't, should. I, I'm happy to speak normally. Okay. I feel like a tour guide. Because you've been in here. Just hit. beware that the ceiling might fall on your head. Okay, please be careful on the stairs. We will be. These are concrete if ones. You feel the floor as you walk across, so that's what the ceiling might be like when we walk. Across. So, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, you don't have to. These are made of stone. These are all made of stone. Emergency boarding. We won't go to the top. Jack, you're yeah. really careful when you stand. I will. I'm standing at the corner wall. I want to do a photo shoot over there. Against that wall? Bella. At the end of Twilight. In the dance, in the dance studio, yeah. yeah. So that's the front. I'm going to move over. I am. I'm treading where there's lots of stuff. So it will, it, I know it can support. And staying close to the walls. That's where the, the floor has come through. I think that would fall through if I stood on that. So this is like the second level. <laughs> A pigeon just flew like bang on past me. The ladies lose. The men's lose. Gentlemen. The roof's completely collapsed here. That is so cool. Sorry? Yeah, there's the same thing here in this room. And there's a wire. It's been ripped out. I want to go in there, but I can't. So have I. I've been to the toilet. <laughs> I want to find the room where the floor has fallen through. See, and if we went up a level, that would be what we'd be standing. Yeah. On. So. But if you walked, if you walked along the edges where the walls have 
taken the strain. And I think it would be a lot better. I, yeah. I, when I always used to see this place, I thought, well, there's going to be druggies and like homeless people and stuff that live here. This is so cool. My sister was saying it looks a bit like the dance studio in Twilight where um, Bella gets beaten up at the end. This is all concrete. We're on solid ground now. It's only that bit that's on the second level. No, no, this is the ground underneath us because that's outside. And I can hear people out there. Yeah. There's lots of glass here as well because of... That might be covering a hole. <laughs> yeah, this is the front. I remember seeing the windows before it was all boarded up. The windows were all bare. Look at that. It's about to collapse. And that's the floor where it has collapsed. That would be really good. You don't need the torch. No. I know. That's the door outside. Watch out coming through here because... I want to sit in the glass. Sit in the glass? That would be very dangerous. Uh, this is a solid floor, yeah. Don't jump on it, but it is. Uh, should we have waited for Steph? Steph, don't run! We should have waited for Steph. Are you right? Most of this is on the ground level. Yeah. This is all ground level, I think, so we're safe here. This is my birthday treat. So much crap on the floor. There's a door out to the real world. Oh, I just trod on something really grimy. Oh, look at that. That's what I just trod on. Yeah. Yeah. They're pretty solid. Is there a I went before. Walk on the edges. Oh, dude. Have you seen the eggs in the ground? No. Oh, it's screwed in. I don't think I went anywhere on that because look at the floor. Oh, that is a good picture. Yeah, out of here. Down here. And looking out. It's just amazing. Yeah. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't go any further than this. So do I. That's the roof of in there, so I wouldn't go on that either. Yeah, now we're above. We're in the second level. But there's rooms upstairs as well. But we've seen the roof from down there, and that's how unstable it is. And that's just from water damage. If you come up here, and you'll see. Oh, yeah. Oh, not the same I'm not. I'm on the top step. Look at how many dips there are. Yeah, I think that's And so, I will talk to you later. Hey, it's me. Oh, boy, out. Oh, so hot.
well, it was, not anymore. A light wind has come up, so it's not as hot. But I've just been walking around the whole of South Nutfield, um, posting flyers, leaflets, about the Strawberry Food Festival, which is, was Saturday and Sunday. You probably missed it by now. <laughs> In fact, I know you have. Sorry this is such a long video. I, the place that we went to on Monday, the um, car, abandoned car showroom, that was brilliant. As soon as I um, get back from Canada and I'll have my uh, DSLR, I'm going to uh, I'm going to go down there. Probably with Steph because I, I think she'll want to go down there. Maybe Matt because I reckon he'll want to go there as well. Um, and take a load of pictures because it's just brilliant. And it may be the setting for one of my short films, which you will hear more about when they they get a bit further. They're still in the planning stages at the moment. But I will, I will tell you about them when anything happens. And so, I will talk to you later. Bye-bye. You've just watched Jack Catford.